I'm here at the Wilson School Building where a public meeting was held Monday night. Many people from the community came out to voice their concern over the future of fine arts education in the school district. We were thoughtful and you basically spit in the face of the arts. We heard from the fine arts community. Um, you saw that there were, um, there were no K-12 fine arts teachers making public comment. It was the external community. Superintendent Casey Bertram says this means they've done a good job communicating to teachers and administrators, but... We have more work to do on the external communication. Folks face the Board of Trustees concerned over the elimination of the Fine Arts Director position, which Bertram says is no longer needed to be an administrative position. A teacher on special assignment could move into that role. The role of the Fine Arts Director was mostly tied to the school district's K-12 music programming. It's a support role for teachers in terms of um, evaluating um, K-12 music teachers um, and supporting K-12 Fine Arts um, staff, um, but also supporting all the coordination and logistics for the many events that occur in the fine arts. Bertram says even though this administrative position is eliminated, parents shouldn't expect the arts to go away in Bozeman. We're not anticipating any major changes to K-12 fine arts programming within the district. Um, it's important to clarify that the reduction of the administrative position doesn't mean that fine art supports go away. In fact, Bertram says they are working on new ways to expand fine art offerings that are not as accessible to K-5 and K-8 students as they are for K-12. Um, visual arts in our K-5 schools and then theater arts in our K-8 schools are areas of um, that we have some equity work to do. Bertram is encouraging anyone with questions to reach out about any of the budget reductions. You can visit our website for more information. In Bozeman, Joe Lisa Lee, MTN News.